What is going on everybody? It's Captain Blue Shell coming back to you today with yet another Star Wars Battlefront 2 episode. Today, just like we did the light side, today we are doing the dark side of the arcade battle scenarios. Um, it's uh, it's basically going to be the same amount of uh, scenarios. There's going to be eight in total, obviously two as well. Um, we're going to be kind of taking a uh, different look, a different approach. Obviously, it's the dark side, so let's go ahead and check and see what it's got in store for us, shall we? Uh, stick with me, it's Captain Blue Shell. Well, 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 if it isn't Captain Blue Shell. This one too, ladies and gentlemen, we are getting right into it. Uh, no horsing around because we do have a lot to go through. Uh, this one, <laughs> we've got Darth Maul, heck yeah. And another droid, but you're not gonna pick a droid over Darth Maul. I'm sorry, we're just we are going Darth Maul. <laughs> it's such a it's a good kickoff to uh, hopefully a really good uh, scenario uh, line. And uh, Darth Maul's always been my favorite Sith Lord. Like he's just so stinking awesome, man. Like even the actor who plays him is just ab is he's an absolute beast. I want to see what our specialties are. Whoa! Holy crap, so he's got like two kung fu moves and a force chokehold. That's freaking awesome, man. I want you to see these moves, though, that he has. Like, that's crazy if we're up close. And then this one is just like, boom. He's like, out of my way. If you have like a line of enemies. Dude, that's, that's that is nuts, dude. That's crazy. He's like all over the place, just like in the movie too, but uh, nobody's ever had the lightsaber experience like he did in the movies. Like, I'm sorry, but the scene where him, Obi-Wan, and Qui-Gon Jinn are about to battle, like, there's no, there's just no way to like replicate that. There really isn't. Like, they tried to give Kylo Ren you know, like the awesome bad A, like sound effects and vibration, because, you know, somehow a lightsaber has to, you know, like vibrate and this and that to be epic. But Darth Maul, I mean, it's just, it's still a simple, like, lightsaber, but it is, like, it's so, it's just so unique. And I know with Kylo Ren, what they were trying to do is they were trying to, like, up one, you know, they were trying to, like, up one him. Cause they're like, oh, well, if Darth Maul's got two uh, dual lightsaber, oh, what's one more than two? I know three. Oh, somehow give him three, and then it's like they're just trying to up the bounty. But you can't, you can't compare with Darth Maul, man. You just can't. And the choreography in that movie with him, I'm going off on a Darth Maul tangent. I know, but we're playing as Darth Maul, and we just completely annihilated. I just kind of like. I went into focus mode. Like, what had happened was that I blacked out just talking about Darth Maul. And before I know it, it's like we're done. It just says victory. That's how Darth Maul does it. So, Darth Maul for you, ladies and gentlemen. We are ready for the next scenario, Yavin, for unlimited, pow uh, unlimited power with Palpatine and Vader. I have not played as Palpatine. I'm going to try it out. I don't know... Do we have a lights? No, we can't have a lightsaber. Wait, what do we? Oh, it's lightning? W dude, what? Are you kidding me? What are our specialties, though, then? Like that? Dude. Holy crap. That's... That's, that's scary. That's crap, man. What does the other one do? I have to see what the other one does, guys. Hold up. I, I have to find some more enemies. <laughs> I love how he runs. <laughs> <laughs> I love how he just kind of... He doesn't really run. He just... Holy crap, dude. What is going on? Um, He just kind of hops... Hops along in his cloak. It's just... It's the funniest thing I've ever seen. Um, What is it? Dude. Dude. Did you see that? Hold on, I gotta go to the light and show you guys this again. This is ridiculously crazy. All right, I'm gonna wait for these guys. I'm gonna wait for these uh, these things to uh, to boost back up. 
Oh, come on. Leave me some enemies to, to actually... This one's almost uh, boosted up here. Hold up. I need kind of like a group of them because I want to show you guys this up close too. All right, so these guys are going to be our guinea pigs. Watch this. So it's that, and then we do this, or like, or that. That's crazy, man. I just, I wish we had a lot more enemies like in an area or something to, to do it with, but. So basically, we just, we're literally just controlling the lightning on these guys. This is just, it's crazy. It really is. Man. It's like we're just like draining out power. Like we're just draining out their life with electricity. This is just, it's its absolutely mad. It's mad. Oh, us with our dark tornado again. Holy crap, dude. That's just freaky. And then just how he hops along in his cloak to make it even more disturbing. It's just, it's all kinds of, it's very dark. There is no scarier person on this game than Emperor Palpatine. Because like when you see him running towards you, you don't know, like just straight up running, you know, about to kill you in the hood. It's like little black riding hood. He's just hopping along like little pippy long stockings there. And then, like, you get shocked and electrocuted in a dark black tornado. I mean, what's... I, I can't think of a scarier death than that. I'm sorry, I can't. I'm just gonna shock you. Shocking, isn't it? I have that effect on women. Ha-ha! Palpatine. Oh, Palpatine. Oh, you sly devil, you. Alright, let's keep electrocuting people. It's time for a dark tornado. This guy's like, oh, I can't see because of the dark tornado. And then it's like, oh, you're dead. It's just... Palpatine is so, like, out there. I, I really I really like using him. Because, I mean, he's... I mean, obviously, every hero has the buff and health. But he's... I mean, he's a tank. I mean, he really is, so... Oh, I got the... I got his friend there too that's crazy I can electrocute more than one people in a row oh, crap dude I've got him I got him booyah look at that in the slow motion in the slow-mo man Palpatine for the win bro that's I mean that's that's settled he's he's, he's got it man and with that next uh, scenario star killer base these resistance fools that's right right Kylo Ren Oh, we get to play as Kylo Ren or a flame trooper. Eh, let's stick with Kylo Ren because I kind of want to check and see his, um, you know, because we were, you know, making fun of him before, so might as well, you know, redeem him. Um, I don't know what his uh, specialties are going to be. Let's go ahead and check and see it right off the box here, though. All right, so we've got a little, so he plays the statue game with the enemies. And then, what else do we got? We've got... Oh, so we've got a force pole, I guess. And then... Oh, okay, so we just kind of chop them up. So it's basically... So it's a force... It's a force pole. It's a freeze frame. And then we've got the special ability with his... Uh, his lightsaber. I mean, that's pretty cool. I mean, it's it's nothing out there. It's nothing special, but um, you know, I mean, I don't I don't have anything bad to say about him, you know, in the movie, like as an actor. The actor, dude, I love the guy who played him. He is like I saw him so much like on Saturday Night Live. He cracked me up so much, man. He's got such a great like sense of acting. Like, I mean, he does not break character either. I mean, he doesn't break very easily. I mean, when he's, like, serious and, like, into it, it's, uh, it, it's really cool. No, I mean, I think the, uh, I think the Kylo Ren aspect, I think it was pretty bad, A, eh, for, like, the first ten minutes. And then, like, with his helmet, it just kind of lost me. So, I mean, like, the, the helmet was so, like, cool and everything, but then seeing that, it was like, uh... I don't know. Uh, 
we go. Sweet. Um, but yeah, it's uh, he was cool for the first couple minutes, and I was like, eh. But the actor is awesome, and he's pretty cool in the game too as well. So thumbs up. All right, next scenario. Nabu, Roger, Roger. The assault on Nabu has begun. So we are droids. I have to remember that we are droids. We are not. We're not with. Uh, we have to target these guys this time because reasons. And uh, I can't get that mixed up. Because, like I told you guys, I got that mixed up one time and uh, it didn't end very well. Because <laughs> I thought these guys were on my team and I'm like, why is my team shooting at me and killing me? And uh, it's because they weren't on my team. So it's very confusing um, with clone troopers and stormtroopers because you get so used to something so quick and then just like your subconscious just tries to take over and you're not really thinking about it and it's like well, we kind of got to put some thought in here you know i'm glad that my weapon overheated at the end there instead of uh right at the uh right at the beginning of that battle there or that encounter anyway all right, we gotta go up and help out our uh, our troops here. Is it the exact same um, specialties though for this? Oh, yeah, it is. Okay, it's the exact same specialties, which I mean, obviously, you know, makes sense. But I just have to, you know, check and see. So we got our shotgun here. I love the shotgun. I really do. I don't know how many rounds or anything we have of it, but I really like the shotgun. So. Oh, I guess, I guess we're out, so. And I got no more grenades. Because I, I completely wasted one. Um. Oh, there we go. I've got another one now. I'm gonna use it. There we go. Hopefully bounce off the wall and kill that guy. I don't know if we did. What are you doing? Go, get out of the doorway, man. Just keep moving. You're a droid. You're programmed to just move. Like, you don't really die. You just kind of, like, shut down so weird like once you think about it you know come on come on come on come on come on come on where's the other guy where'd he go there you are i knew you were here somewhere oh oh no 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 it's the guy with the uh the blaster cannon i hate blaster cannons no matter who i am or what class i'm in i hate blaster cannons but whenever i'm the blaster cannon i die in the first five minutes or the first five seconds. Now, I don't even last a minute, let alone five minutes. Yeah, blaster cannons, I can't... I, I can't do it. Like, I don't know why. Like, if I die, I'll show you guys. But I won't die, so I won't have to show you guys, so it's good. I won't... I won't die. I won't have to show you guys my... You know, my, my suckage and all that. Is that a word? Suckage? Yeah, I'll show you guys my suckage. Come on. There you go. Where are the other where are the other guys? We only got six more to go. That's six more to go. No, hold still. There we go. Four more. Four more to go. Where are they? They're over here somewhere. I think. Oh, I thought so. Are they over here? Oh. Yeah, they're shooting from over there. Hello. Goodbye. We're almost done here. We got two more. Ladies and gentlemen, two more. We got it. Come on, we'll go. We'll go all the way. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, he's trying to hide. He's trying to hide behind the wall there. Mm. How did that bounce off? It bounced off his helmet. It just, like, it literally just went doink and then just came, like, right back at me. I mean, we won, but that was just, like, the, the dude obviously plays soccer. I mean, he's like, hey, there's a ball, boink, it's like, you don't really think about doing that with a grenade, but hey, if it works, it works. All right, next scenario, Tatooine, oh, rebel terrorists threatening the loyal citizens, who else are you going to call? Bounty hunters, baby! We got Boba Fett and Bosk. I don't think I've ever played as Bosk. Let me check out, let me check out Bosk, see what Bos Bosk has got. What did we go, like... Invincible for like 20 minutes. Huh? Is that his power? Yeah, is that? Oh. Oh, man, his blaster is pretty slow. 
I'm not gonna lie, his blaster is very, very slow. I need a specialization of a grenade. And so it's like a smoke grenade, kind of. Or a slime? It's a slime grenade. I'm not making that up. It's a slime grenade that he throws. That's that's crazy though. It's like his blaster is super, super slow. Like, I know it only takes, like, three or four hits to down him, but still, like, holy crap. This is a slow blaster. What's his last, uh, what's his last specialization? I don't want to use it until we're, you know, in, like, trouble, just in case, but... Where are they? Are they coming through the other side here? Yes, they are. Whoa! He just went reptile mode. I don't know what this is. I don't know what's going on. What is happening? I don't know. This is crazy. He just showed us a side of Bosk we've never seen before, ladies and gentlemen. That's crazy, dude. Holy crap. That's like... I mean, that's like some Superman crap going on there. Well, I didn't see that the last time. Here's a slime grenade. You ready for the slime grenade? There we go. I I think it's actually like literally a, a stink bomb. Because everybody over there is going like this. I, I, I don't know how he runs like this. Do you see how he's running? He's literally running like a, like a puppet. Like he's like, uh huh, I'll go this way. It's like... His body goes first, and then... This is scary, Bosk. Bosk is a very, very scary individual. I'm gonna go ahead and die off here real quick, because I really want to see Boba Fett. We only have a minute left. Maybe I should probably... Kill off a little bit more guys if I can. Oh, never mind, it's too late. Alright, seven to go, 55 seconds left. We gotta call it. We gotta call Tom Brady of Star Wars. We gotta call him in. Yes, hello. No! No, 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 no! I didn't mean to... Let's go ahead and just respawn. Let's pretend like that didn't happen. So I'm on the phone, yeah. Yeah, send him in. Send him in, we need it. Yeah, we're at the 10-yard line. Last, you know, we, we gotta get this touchdown. Send in Boba Fett, baby. Here we go. This is it. This is it. This is your time to shine, Boba. We got 45 seconds on the clock. We got seven people. We got a down. This is no joke. Come on, where are the enemies? Where are the enemies at? There we go. Some blaster action here. We got some grenades that I just completely wasted for no apparent reason at all. And we got a jetpack, which I'm not going to be able to use very much, to be honest with you guys. I'm sorry. I know you will not see jetpack action. Because we just, we have to concentrate and do this as best as we can. No, 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 no. We gotta follow him. We gotta follow him. Two more guys. Got each in 10 seconds. Eat this. Booyah! And that was a miss too, but we still got him. So we're good. So if, if it comes down to the line and the wire and you're not sure, gotta call in Boba Fett. No, it's like, as I've learned before in the past with Boba Fett, I am not good at controlling his jetpack at all. It looks like I, I'm literally an inventor that got drunk, invented a jetpack, and just decided to go on a joyride. I just, I, I like, I literally spontaneous combust with the jetpack still on my back. We are ready for the next scenario, Yavin 4. Hope cannot save them. How dare these rebels call themselves something or rather because I don't have time to read it. Uh, we got Death Trooper or Iden Versio. Iden Versio. We're going to go Death Trooper first, but if the Death Trooper cannot handle it, then we're going to bring out our secret weapon, which of course is Iden, which you can play on the main storyline. So, you know, if you haven't played as her, just jump, you know, main storyline and it's... It's pretty much all that you play for, for, for hours, so... Oh! There you are! He came out of nowhere, my good sir. And you too, my good sir. Goodbye, my good sir. They are, like, coming down like they know where I am. 
And they know how to get to me, too. Where's this guy at? Oh, he's running! He's running! Can you run fast enough? Oh, I think he can. <laughs> the guy's got some fast legs there. Never mind, my bad. I want to check out our specialties on these guys. I don't know what that one did. I'm not... Oh, it's a heal! Oh, I didn't even notice that it was like a heal, um... Thing? That's... That's freaking awesome. I didn't even know anybody could even heal, to be honest with you. I'm not sure if officers can heal too or not, but they can do something along those lines, I think. We've got 17 left, two minutes to go. What does this one do? I think it's a boost of shield? I don't think we're going to be making it out. Oh, crap. We're not making it out alive here. <laughs> oh. Did my grenade get anybody? I don't think it did. All right, guys. We're bringing her out. We're bringing out Aiden Versio. Heck yeah. Let's go, girl. And we're literally starting in the worst place to start out. Like right in the middle of the hangar bay. I love the sound of her blaster, though, man. No joke. It's like the coolest thing ever is the sound of her blaster. I had to, I, I waited out of bounds for the heal because uh, we're I mean we're up against a lot of uh, Nasema droid out. That's what that one does. And then this one oh cool we get a shield. I forgot about the shield. So yeah basically we're just hiding behind out of bounds to uh, get our heal up. I don't think that this is gonna happen this time, though. Whoa, I thought we died there. I'm like, what is going on? It's just my camera just went completely crazy. All right, come on, guys. Come on, guys. We got five more. Five more we gotta do. Sending out my droid out again. There we go, there we go, there we go. Got two more, two more we gotta do. Two more. We got this. We got this, guys. We got this. One more. One more we gotta do. Come on. Come on. Yes, we got it. Aiden. Heck yeah for the win. And I gotta say, too, uh, the, uh, the campaign with this game is absolutely awesome. It is unparalleled with the campaign. I love doing the campaign. I love her storyline. So freaking awesome. It's all, all the, all the marks are checked and it's just, it's, it's awesome straight on through. But enough with the main storyline. We're back to Tatooine with the next scenario, uh, execute the Emperor's Fury. We got a rocket trooper. Crap. I don't like jetpack, um, like people. I just, I suck at using them. And two of his specializations, of course, are jetpacks. We've got the one that makes it go forward. Uh, let me guess, the other one is to go up, right? Probably, I'm not gonna use it just yet. What's our other, oh crap. Dude, he literally just pulled the GTA 5. Like he just got the rocket launcher out of his pocket and was like, yep, bye. And just like did it, that's, that's crazy, man. Absolutely crazy. I'm not going to use our jetpack unless I absolutely need to, unless we like get into a bind. Because like I said, I suck at using the jetpack. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's like the gaming mechanics. Like I'm really good at airplane games, like jet fighter games. It's just not jetpack game. I just don't think that people were designed to fly is all, you know. Crap. No, no, no. We have to heal. We have to heal. Ah, oh, I'm so close to healing. So close. And then that guy had to screw it up. You know what? I'm going to be looking for that guy on the field. Because he just screwed up everything for me. So, yeah, like that. Crap. I didn't mean to go over here. See, I already told you guys. I suck at doing this crap. Ugh. All right, what do we got? We got 14 left with 1 minute and 44 to go. I wish he didn't have a jetpack. I'm going to be honest with you. I wish he did not have a jetpack at all. Like, if I could... Like... If I could exchange his jetpack for a Twix bar, or like a Snickers bar, 
I could do much more better with that than what it already is, so. That's not where the rocket launcher was supposed to hit. Oh, crap. So now we got 12 left with 1 minute and 27 seconds. This is going to be a long scenario right here. I'm not going to lie to you. But we have to just start picking them off. We have to get them into, like, an alleyway or something to where they're going to have to come to us. And it's going to have to be a way to where it's going to be harder for them to come at both sides, too. Like, here's a good alleyway, but they're already, like, basically hunting us down both ways, so... It's just, it's not good. Oh, crap. Well, I had to use my rocket launcher there this time. Let's go ahead and try to get out of here if we can. Oh, well, that wasn't half bad. Probably still gonna die, but you know, still got a kill off of it, so I'm happy. Nothing wrong with that. No, no, no. Okay, that was a mistake, but it was a good mistake. So my bad. We got 50 seconds left. 50 seconds, guys. We cannot mess this up. Come on, come on, come on, we can do this. No! Oh my god. Okay, so one kill left. We got one kill left, 45 seconds. We got all the time in the world. We can do this. Basically, literally what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go out, I'm gonna use my rocket launcher, and we'll be done. Booyah, there we go, cool. Game winning point. It's all about the strategy. But like I said, I don't like playing with jetpack people. The humans were just not supposed to fly. You know, if they were, everybody would have a jetpack, right? Am I wrong? Anyway, enough with the jetpacks. We are in Takodana. Embrace the dark side. Show no mercy. Here we go, guys. Who are we gonna pick? Well, we've done Boba Fett. We've bossed the Bosk. Uh, we've done pretty much everybody else. Ooh, Grievous. My old pal, Grievous. We have not done Grievous, and we're going to go ahead and get it done with Grievous. Oh, heck yeah. We're going to celebrate with Grievous. Watch this crap, man. Oh, yeah? You want to go through me? I go through you, baby. That's so... It's such an awesome specialty to use in a hallway or a corridor, and they're all just lined up, and you just go right on through. I love it, man. I really do. And then this, which is, like, freakier than heck, like... Your body is not supposed to go that way, but he can because he's a droid and he just doesn't care, so. Or half droid, or. I, I, to be honest with you, I really don't know what he is, so. But that's cool, you know, we have, we have four lightsabers, so I don't care. There we go. Come on, baby. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Keep, keep it, keep it coming, keep it coming, keep it coming. Look at all these guys, man. I don't know, we might be able to do this in record time. We'll see. I'm not I'm not entirely sure. I hope so. My uh my trigger is not working all that well. I think our energy is low. Yeah, let's go ahead. Oh! They got me. They got me. I was too focused in on my uh my energy. We're sending out BB9E. <laughs> because we can't. I don't know. I, I've i never played as BB-90. What are we doing? What even is... What is going on? What are we doing? Dude! It's the spinning little ball of death! This is crazy! How am I... How am I killing people? Do I hold it down? Or is it just a one-time shot... I, I don't really know. Who's going to get it done for us? Who's going to get this done? It's going to be Count Dooku. Count Dooku out for revenge just because because he's angry. He's got some anger to let loose. I don't blame him. He's going to get it done, man. Oh. There we go. That's a force. And that guy's still stunned from our, uh, our stunner. That's crazy, dude. Yeah, man, Count Dooku. When Count Dooku's coming for you, you're, uh, 
you know, they they call it. They say when Dooku's coming for you, you might as well be covered in Dookie. That's that's what they say. It's either Dooku or Dookie. That's horrible. What? How does that? How, I'm an old man. I hope you feel good about yourself, young stupid boy. Okay, guys, for our last kill, we'll do Captain Phasma, okay? Watch we somehow die, like before. Which one should we even... This one? Yeah, there we go. Yeah, use the spear. Good old-fashioned spear. Why not? I'm tired of all this stupid blaster and shooting nonsense, all these snipers and jetpacks. Just use a spear. You know, Captain Phasma's got a right. That was a lot of fun, besides the jetpacks, and I hope that you guys enjoyed it too, uh, going through the scenario of the dark side. The light side was fun, dark side was fun. This game is just fun. I love Battlefront 2 just as a whole. So um, definitely stick with me. More videos coming out with Battlefront 2, so follow, like, subscribe. Join the Blue Shell family, and I will see you guys on the next adventure. It's Captain Blue Shell. I'm out, baby!